Look at this dude. Man, this has been a few months since I last uploaded on this channel, huh? <laughs> Whoa, it's popping, everybody. Welcome back to another video. Whoa, hey man, if you haven't already, then so. Make sure you are subscribed to the channel, smash the like button, click that bell while you're at it to be a part of the post the gang family, best family on YouTube. And that's no cap handstand. And for the ones that don't know, this is my second reaction channel, main channel reaction. Main channel react. Main reaction channel. There we go. <laughs> this is going to be the link is in the description if you guys don't know who I am. But hey, man, look. We are here for one reason and one reason only. We are here to re-react to SML movie, The DNA Test. <laughs> We're gonna do less talk and more reacting. Let's dive right into this video. Let go. All right, guys, you ready to play superheroes? Oh yeah, dude, but I'm the Joker. I'm Batman. I wanna be Batman. No, Cody. No, Cody. I'm always Batman. You have to be someone else. Be Robin. I don't want to be stupid, stinky, ugly, dumb Robin. Okay, well, then go choose someone, but you can't be Batman. Out of all three of them, I'd rather be the Joker. Oh, oh, Junior, you have another Batman. We can both be Batman. We both can't be Batman, Cody. There's only one Batman. Yeah, that's against the rules, dude. Yeah, that's against the rules. Yeah, yeah, we... Where's the rule book? Can I look? Hey, Batman, it's me, other Batman. No, you're one of those dumb Batmans that work on Times Square. What? Well, okay, Cody, look, we can both be Batman, but you're the uh, you're the Ben Affleck Batman. I'm Christian Bale. Well, I don't want to be Ben Affleck Batman. He was fat. Okay, well, then don't be Batman at all. Go be Mexican Superman. But, Junior, Mexican... you always make me be Mexican Superman. Where did Mexican Superman come from? The hell? Mexican Superman's the coolest. Yeah, Mexican Superman's awesome, dude. He always saves the day right in time to make it to his daughter's quinceanera. Yeah, he's so awesome. Lara. All right, let's get this over with. Okay. Hey, I'm the bad guy, the Joker. You can't beat me in Batman. Oh, well, you don't understand who I have as my secret weapon. Who? Come on, say your thing. <sighs> so you Mexican Superman. <gasps> oh, no, not Mexican Superman with Batman. My two arch nemesis, I'm out. Yes, and you don't understand what he had up his sleeve. Say it. Hot plate. Oh, not a hot, hot plate. Hot plate. Oh no, that's my weakness. Yeah. Now hit him with the Baja blast. You. Oh. This is so racist, bro. Oh Baja blast. Oh, I'm melting. I'm melting. And now you better get out of here before he gets the Gordita crunch. Oh, not the Gordita mm. crunch. Yay! We saved the day. Haliba. Haliba. Right. You want to watch TV or something? Oh yeah. Uh, let's watch TV. Ugh. Hey there, have you ever wondered if you were related to someone famous? Well, now you can find out. Just call me at 1-800-FAMOUS-DNA-TESTERS. Yeah, it doesn't sound like you just made that up on the spot, my boy. Come, and I'll personally come to your house and tell you who you're related to. You might even be related to Jeff Bezos. Maybe he owes you some money. Maybe maybe you're like a long-lost kid of his or something. Come find out. Oh, guys, guys, guys. I want to get DNA tested. <laughs> I want to see what famous person I'm related to. I don't know, Junior. That place looks like a scam. Yeah, I want to get tested, too. Uh, I bet I'm related to Abraham Lincoln. Oh, that'd be so cool. I know, right? I bet I'm related to George Washington Carver. Ooh. Who's that? The guy who invented peanut butter? Duh. Oh, well, why For would real? you be related to him? Because he's smoother than peanut butter. Duh. Yeah, Cody. Who do you think you're related to? A dork? <laughs> Dr. Dork? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, a Robert E. Dork? <laughs> Professor Dork with a degree? Uh, yeah, Ulysses S. Dork? <laughs> Captain Dork with a ship? Yeah, yeah. Elon Musk. Cody, you getting roasted. Posted on like a muck right now, bruh. Musky dork. <laughs> yeah. Dork, dorky, dorky. Yeah. Dorky, uh, dorky. dork. <laughs> My life is a teenage dork bot. Yeah. These are just TV shows. Uh, uh, a dork and Josh. <laughs> dork and Josh. Uh, dorky. Oh, man. Dorky. Uh, ima dorks. Imaginary home for dorks. Yeah. Uh, uh, what's it called? Um, a cat dork. South dork. <laughs> uh, south dork. Uh, How many dorks are we going to come up with, bruh? Dork. Uh, a dork, a cinnamon toast dork, uh, Rick and Dorky, yeah, yeah. Rick and Dorky, uh, 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 dorks, a bunch of dorks. Oh, 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 um, I got one. Uh, this is the dork life of, of Zach and Dorky. Oh, on deck, on, on deck, deck, on deck. Okay, I will get DNA tested just so I can prove I'm not a dork. Oh uh, yeah, let's go. Cody, you are a dork. There's nothing wrong with being a dork, by the way, but Cody, you are a dork. Oh, doctor, should we get DNA tested? Dork. Hey, did somebody <laughs> call a doctor to get DNA tested? Yeah, we saw the commercial and we want to do the test to see who we're related to. Oh, it's really fun. You never know who you'll be related to. Like, I did it, and my great grandmother was Amelia Earhart. Really? Yeah, yeah, it explains why I'm so good at hide and seek and so bad at flying planes. So, so how do we do it? Well, you see these DNA sample tubes? Yeah. Well, you just take some bodily fluid and put it in the tube. 
Okay, so like, I can spit in it? Yeah, sure, or whatever else. It doesn't really matter. Ooh, can I poop in it? Yeah, sure, why not? Yes. Oh, I know what I'm putting in there. All right, so oh, we know. Cody, go home. Uh, after we put the stuff in there, then what happens? I just run it back to the lab, then I'll have your results by the next scene. Okay, I'm gonna spit in mine. <laughs> Time to poop. Oh, man, Time to guys, poop. I can't wait for our test results to be ready. All right, your test results are ready. They're ready? Are they cool? Oh, they're cool. All right, Cody, we're gonna start with you. The most famous person you're related to is Thomas Edison. Whoa, no way, dude. Oh, that's so sick. Who am I related to? You. You're Probably like a janitor or some ish. <laughs> Related to Neil Armstrong. Neil Armstrong, the first man on the moon. I knew I knew a lot about space. Whoa, an astronaut, dude. Oh, I know, it's so cool. Oh. Okay, Joseph, you're related. Martin Luther King. Oh, oh, oh. Osborne man, I always Dorsey. Knew I had a dream. Uh, I dream every night. No, no, no. Inventor of the doorknob. Close. Osborne Dorsey. Uh, who's that? He's the inventor of the doorknob. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. I'm always good with, you know, turning doorknobs. Yep, you have fun with that information. Oh, this is so cool. All right, guys, can we just admit? Yeah, let's just admit that Brooklyn uh, Brooklyn guy just uh, is, is, is scamming y'all right now. That I'm related to the coolest person ever, Neil freaking Armstrong. No, Edison is cooler because he invented the light bulb. Without him, we'd be in the dark right now. No, because if Edison wouldn't have invented it, somebody else would have invented the light bulb. Dude, the only way you would have been able to get inside your house today is because of my boy Dorsey. Well, no, because then Walmart invented those automatic doors. What? Yes, yeah, so you don't even need doorknobs. We don't even need him. See, 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 Neil Armstrong, he discovered the moon. He didn't discover the moon, Junior. He just went there. Yeah, and they say the first person to go on land discovered that land. So he was the first person on the moon. So he discovered the moon. And he got there with his cool spaceship. He flew there, landed, he got out, and then he danced on the moon. Dude, he, he wouldn't be able to get on his spaceship without a doorknob. Well, he wouldn't be able to see the doorknob without a light bulb. Well, he, he wouldn't have been able to go to the moon if he would have discovered the moon in the first place. Dude, you use doorknobs for anything. No, no, you use light bulbs more because you use them every day. Uh, have you ever heard of a candle? Well, 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 well the, the moon lights up the sky at night. So, so, because without the moon, it would, uh... It would be... It would be dark. Yeah, without... Light bulb. No, it's out the moon. We it's, 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 you wouldn't even know it was nighttime until you... Oh. How about we just stop arguing? Y'all all at a... Um... Everyone played their part in regards of inventing certain things, discovering certain things to make life a little bit easier nowadays. Open the doorknob! Well, no, 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 you, would, you wouldn't know. Well, actually, there's windows. See, Bill Gates invented windows, so you could look out the window. So we don't even need the doorknob. Who cares? But without doorknobs, we wouldn't even have knock-knock jokes. Ha, that's better. Oh, well, without light bulbs, you wouldn't even be able to see. Without doorknobs, we wouldn't even have knock-knock <laughs> I'm dead. He was at the door to answer it. Well, without, without the moon, you wouldn't know it was nighttime, so you know not to answer the door because not, scary people come at night or fans who don't know the rules. So, so, so that, <laughs> yeah. And see, without the moon, we would I know Logan 30 Acre was talking about, he was ranting about some of y'all showing up to his crib, bro. We'd have waves. And without waves, we wouldn't have ships that would bring you materials to make your stupid light bulbs and to make your stupid doorknobs. So, so actually, you know what, Cody? I'm suing you. But why? I'm suing you because Thomas Edison got the idea for a light bulb by looking at the moon. Because he went outside and he said, ooh, I like that little light in the sky. Ooh, ooh I, I want to make one for my own. So he made a light bulb based on the moon. So I'm suing you. Yeah, yeah I'm suing you too, Cody, because there's no way Mr. Edison could make his light bulb without opening a door from Mr. Dorsey. Yeah, 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 yeah. See, 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 so Cody, you owe Joseph my Well, actually... Joseph, you owe Cody money because because without the light bulb, Dorsey wouldn't have been able to make a doorknob without light. Nah, 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 nah. We had candles, bro. We had candles. And we have sunlight. Oh, yeah, yeah candles. Okay, so, so Cody, yeah, you owe both of us money. Well, I'm not giving either <laughs> of you money. Well, we don't need your stupid, dumb light bulbs, Cody. Well, okay, I'll just take away all the light bulbs in your house and see how you like it. We don't need them because we have the moon to light up everything. Nobody's going to need doorknobs then. Yeah, we don't need that either because I just have a door. I can just push the door open. I don't need a doorknob. That's dumb. I, I like Walmart automatic doors. I'm lazy. Yeah, you know what? I'm, I'll take the moon away. And then what were y'all gonna do when y'all can't see at night? Oh man, this is such a huge mess. It's gonna take forever to clean up. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, it's not gonna clean itself, so you better stop complaining, my boy. Wait, what happened to the lights? <laughs> oh, it must have been a power outage. Uh, hey, Chef PP. Wait, C Cody, what are you doing? Uh, do you know if there are any more light bulbs in the house? Wait, 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 why are you stealing our light bulbs? Oh, I'm not stealing these. I own these. My great great grandfather was Thomas Edison. Look, I don't care who your great grandfather is. Put my light bulbs back. Tell that to Junior. He thinks Thomas Edison didn't do anything. What? Look, put my light bulbs back! And done. I just finished my Apollo 11 Lego sculpture. So I'm just like my great great grandfather, Neil Armstrong. What, what happened to the lights? And talk to your boy, Cody, my boy. 
Hey, Junior. What are you doing here, Cody? Well, I'm just collecting all of my light bulbs that my great-great-grandfather invented. Wait, wait, you stole my light bulbs? Oh, I'm not stealing them. Since my great-great-grandfather invented them, they're mine. Well, well, I was building my Apollo 11 Lego sculpture. See, look, there's me, and there's my great-great-grandfather, Neil Armstrong. See, see, um, I, I didn't see any light bulbs on the Apollo 11. Yeah, that's great. Well, I'm going to just take all of these light bulbs back to my house where I'll have all the light. Well, well, when you're walking home, guess what's going to help you light up the streets when you get home? Uh, the moon. Well, there are also street lights. And guess what's in those street lights? Light bulbs! Well, well, you're dumb and, and stupid. Good comeback, Junior. Good comeback. <laughs> uh, Joseph, get out of my way. Uh, 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 where do you think you're going? Home. Uh, home? Doorknob. Where? Through this door? You know you gotta use this circular thing. What's it called again? A doorknob. Can I please use the doorknob? I guess so. For a thousand dollars, and if you praise my great granddad, Dorsey. Well, I don't have a thousand dollars. Well, get an appraisal. Hey, Cody, bring me back my light bulbs. Oh, now you want them. I thought they were useless. Well, they are useless, but I bought them, so they're technically mine now. Oh, look at that. I forgot one. Hold on. Well, Cody, don't, don't grab that one. Don't light. do it. Oh, oh, come on, Cody. That's well, well, at least you can't get through this door. Oh, uh, yeah. Okay, Junior, I'm going out your window. Well, well, uh, so, so where are you going now, Cody? I'm going Busy. home. Well, the whole walk home, you better not ever look up. If you ever look up at the moon, you owe me $100. Okay, fine. I don't want to look at the moon. I've seen it before. You better not ever look up. Don't look up. I'm not. Don't look up. Don't look up. Junior, I'm not looking at the moon. You better not look up. <sighs> Junior, are you going to follow me all the way home? Yeah, because I don't want you to look up at the moon because that's my moon. That's my great-grandfather's moon. You can't look at it. If you look at it, you owe me $100. I'm not going to look at it. Don't look at it. Don't look at it. Oh, my God, Cody. Like, if there was a time to look at it, you should look at it now. It's the most beautiful full moon in the world right now. Oh, oh, Cody, look, there's a man on the moon. Junior, there's no man on the moon. There was. My great-grandfather, Neil Armstrong, he was on the moon. That was the man on the moon, the only man on the moon. And that's why I own the moon. And you better not look at it or you owe me $100. Junior, shut up. It's the most beautiful. They're taking this DNA test way too serious. Full moon in the world. Like, if you want to look at it, you can pay me $100. I don't care, Junior. Like, this walk home would be so boring if you didn't have the moon right there. That big, beautiful moon brightening up the streets. Junior, I'm not looking at it. it would have been, you better not look at it. You better not look at it. I'm not going to look at it. Are you sure? Yes. It's so pretty. Okay, I'll let you look at it one time. No. I'll let you, free, for free. You can look at it one time. No, I don't even want to now. Look at it for free, like one time. Shut one up, time. Junior, look away. at it for free. Junior, you broke all my light bulbs. Well, they technically weren't your light bulbs. They were mine because I bought them. Junior, you owe me so much money now. Well, no, I don't. Just because you invented them doesn't mean that I don't own them if I buy them. Like, I'll sell you a piece of the moon. How about that? No, Junior, I don't care. I don't want to see you right now. Well, no, I'll, I'll sell you one piece of the moon if you stop getting mad. God, I can't if you stop stand getting mad. Yet. Where do you think you're going, Cody? In my house. Oh, in your house? Don't you think you have to use a doorknob? Well, well yeah, but J Joseph, this is ridiculous. This is my house. But this is my doorknob. A Dorsey doorknob. <sighs> okay, fine. I guess I'll use a window. <laughs> Get the Man, they are so petty, bro. Hey, hey, I'm telling you, Brooklyn guy is scamming them, too. Diamond. They are going for no reason. I'm just going to sit on my couch with no light. Well, you know what? I do have light. I have the moon, and it's just the the roof is blocking the moon. But I don't need stupid dumb light bulbs. They're dumb. Hey, uh, wait, why is it so dark in here? Oh, my friend's great-great-grandfather was uh, uh, the inventor of light bulbs, so he took all my light bulbs. Oh, yeah, about that. I have an important update about your DNA test results. Uh, can you get your friends back here? I can try, but they're really mad at me. Yeah, uh, just so you know, there's also a guy who's over by your front door charging people $1,000 to use his doorknob. <sighs> That's Joseph. Joseph, get up here! Get Cody! What is it, Junior? The doctor says he has to tell us something. What do you want, dude? Cody. Cody, can we please have a light bulb just while you're here? Okay, but you only get one. <sighs> All right, doctor, what'd you have to tell us? Well, it uh, looks like- I wonder what Brooklyn guy has to tell you. Test results I gave you before were wrong. Wrong? Wait, I'm not related to Neil Armstrong? Nope. No. Well, well, Cody's not re related to Thomas Edison? Nope. Well, well, Joseph's not related to Dorsey? No. Well, then who are we related to? Well, I got your real test results right here. Let's start with Joseph. You are related to Michelangelo. Oh, dude, that's, that's pretty cool. Awesome. I've always wanted to be a Ninja Turtle, and I already lived in sewers. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Junior, you are related to Crush from Finding Nemo. I mean, that's still pretty cool. Like, what's up, Jelly Man? What's up, Jelly Man? Hey, Jelly Man. Hey, Jelly Man. And you, Cody, are related to Vern from Over the Hedge. <laughs> <laughs> Over the Hedge? Vern? 
<laughs> I hope you haven't seen that movie. Yeah, you guys, you guys have fun with that information. I haven't watched that movie in a minute. Do we even have to discuss who's related to the cooler turtle? Dude, it's me. I'm a ninja. No, it's me. He Joseph's got the better one. Rode the East Australian current. No one else did that. Well, I went over the hedge. <laughs> Congrats, Cody. Went over the head. Vern. Vern. What kind of name is Vern? Uh, give me my libels back, you oh, dork. Gosh. Who would you want to be related to? Um. I don't know, to be honest. That's actually a good question. Who would I want to be related to? That's a good question. I haven't even thought about that. I'm going to try to come up with something, and then I'll let you guys know maybe in a future video. <laughs> if you guys made it to the end, I do greatly, greatly appreciate it, man. Smash the like button, leave a comment down below. Click that bell while you're at it. Till next time, I'm going to see y'all next time. I'm out.